We've been talking about last night was one of the most spectacular displays of the Northern Lights we have ever seen here in the QCA. Yeah, and we were not alone. The Northern Lights were visible as far south as Florida. So why was this one so visible? First Alert meteorologist Kyle Dickens breaks down the cause of this phenomena and how best to capture it. It was a light show like no other. No matter where you live across the two state or even the country, the Northern Lights painted the night skies, giving millions a light show like never before. For Eastern Iowa and Northwestern Illinois, while the Northern Lights aren't all that rare, they're certainly not common. However, what is very rare is our ability to see the Northern Lights with our own eyes, which we were able to do. And what could be considered exceptionally rare is just how far south the phenomena was visible. So why was this one so powerful? Well, the Northern Lights, also known as the Aurora Borealis, are caused by solar wind that carry charged particles from the sun that then impact Earth. But in most cases, Earth's magnetic field deflects those particles. But just like Earth, the sun experiences storms, although these storms are far different. When solar storms occur, an increased amount of these solar particles are ejected out of the sun. This is called a coronal mass ejection. And lately, we have seen some very strong ones. When we get towards increased solar activity, we see more of these flares and prominences, coronal mass ejections ejecting this material, and that produces more of these light shows. The Space Weather Prediction Center ranks geomagnetic storms into five categories, with G1 being the weakest and G5 being the highest. On Tuesday, the solar storm that created the stunning display peaked with a planetary K index rating of 9, which brings it to a G5 strength storm. This strength is exceedingly rare and is typically registered on average of four times in an 11 year solar cycle. And while many people have captured amazing photos of this natural wonder, those who went outside to view it for yourself may have been slightly disappointed with what you saw. Now, for those looking to capture the Northern Lights for yourself, here's a quick tip. If using a cell phone, make sure to turn on night mode in your camera app. Night mode helps draw in more light, creating a more vivid look to your picture. Over the next few days, additional solar storm activity is expected. So if you missed out, you just might have another chance to capture one of Earth's most spectacular wonders. Kyle Dickens, KWQC TV 6 News. And even if that storm is weakening just a little, you can still send us those pictures of the northern lights. If you see them tonight, you can send it straight to six. We have a form you can fill it on our website, kwqc.com, or you can submit photos through our news app or the KWQC First Alert weather app.